Hello dear Peace Church and Peace Church friends, this is Katie. I was wondering what my contribution to the Advent calendar could be and thinking about Advent, decided to take the letters of Advent and create a reminder from each one to focus on during these days. For example, A could be for adoration and astonishment. Like the shepherds and the wise men, we stand in wonder at God who comes close to us as a human being. Truly God is with us, will not leave us or forsake us. D is for daring and dedication. Jesus himself took the greatest risk, exposing himself to our response. And what did we say? What will we say? May we live with willingness to go sometimes beyond our comfortable places and with dedication, following the footsteps of Jesus, saying yes to the next step of the journey. V is for vow. And what is that but an expression of our intention? Maybe we can start each day with an intention to live by our values and there's another V. The values shown in Jesus of justice, mercy and loving kindness. To live a life of purpose. E is for encouragement and empathy. Encourage, encourage, how we need that. Let's see Jesus in each other, accepting the differences, offering forgiveness when we make mistakes as we often do. N, and I've cheated a bit here, is for Neugier, that's the German word for curiosity. To maintain a sense of wonder, leaving behind resignation and despair, knowing we are deeply loved. And T for trust. We come to God as children do, knowing they are loved. We come with complete confidence that we will be received in safety. In our darkest moments, and most joyful, and everything in between, we can remember love <coughs> can be trusted. So there we are, Advent. Do I live like this? No, not all the time. Moments, maybe. So I, we, rely on the wisdom and companionship of God to draw us on and make us a changing people. I'd like to close with a, an extract from a, one of my favourite books, The Celtic Wheel of the Year. It's a prayer. Praise to you, God with us, for coming as we prepare for you, for creeping into the homes, midst the chatter and laughter and the spices warming, for passing through the late night shoppers, midst the dimly lit anxiety, for wandering into the churches, midst the hopes and fears felt by the orange glow of the crib for being present in the refugee camps, the war zones, the homes where there is little peace. Come, hope bringer. Bless us with patience when the world still weeps. Bless us with courage to never give up believing in peace. Bless us with work that we may do our part. And bless us with prayer as we light our candles against the darkness. Love. Come down to our little day today.